Hi guys, Bernie G and Taekwondo, you are teacher to this channel. This is my basic acrylic painting tutorial with beautiful and colorful subjects. And beginners can learn and do this easily by following very simple instruction that I made to this tutorial. And guys, don't forget to subscribe my channel for more free painting tutorial in the near future and also updates on my channel. And guys, these are the list of colors that I used to this painting demonstration. You can also find this list of colors below to the description of this video. Now let's get started here guys. Uh, I'm going to uh, use this one, the 10 inches by 12 inches uh, canvas, a plain white canvas. Uh, in this tutorial guys, uh, I'm going to uh, recreate my uh, uh, last tutorial, uh, last year tutorial this tutorial because I did not uh, uh, make the uh, full tutorial of this video because during the time my computer is uh, affected by harmful uh, viruses and I decided to reformat my desktop and I and sadly to say I did not recover my video tutorial that's why I did not uh, make the uh, full tutorial of this painting so for now uh, let's try to recreate this painting and maybe there are some changes of this painting or maybe we we will uh, improve this painting a little bit also the same process of painting what I did last year that also I, uh, you can see to my channel but it's only a time-lapse version so for now we're going to uh, recreate the painting so first thing to do we're going to create the uh, outline here because this painting is a uh, subject is the waterfalls and also some autumn autumn trees and now let's gonna create the uh, outline first so I'm going to uh, use this one the uh, cobalt blue I will uh, create the uh, outline here uh, this one is this is my clip clip here and this one also and I will add here a waterfalls at the very center. Then the upper portion is my trees here. I will add here a trees. There, this is my cliff. Then a little bit water here, the waterfalls or the lake, a small a lake. Then I will add here a newer cliff and the soil here or in the stones here. And the and this one is the exit of my water. In this area then I will add here trees the near trees or the autumn trees as you uh, see it to my old version of my painting so now this is my cliff waterfalls the trees around around the waterfalls and the autumn trees some uh, autumn trees here and a near cliff and stones and water here and the exit of my water so that's it and now let's get started now so the first thing to do is I'm going to create here a lighter uh, uh, trees at the far portion, so I will paint that one directly the tight in white there. I'll paint directly the tight in white. Uh, that area there. Don't worry, we will blend this blue color, uh, the cobalt blue, there. Then the uh, after that, I will uh, paint also directly the cobalt blue here for my trees at the far portion. Maybe I'm going to mix first the cobalt blue and the titanium white to create the sky blue color. To create more lighter sky blue, just add more titanium white. And I will paint here, just paint directly here for my farther trees there, there. I did not add here the mountains because uh, in the end it will uh, cover to the other subject or the trees. So all I have to do is just make, I will make here trees, the farther trees, there, then the titanium white, I'm going to add here the titanium white, I'm going to paint directly here the titanium white, and also I'm going to uh, blend here, blend a little bit here, the titanium white here, I will add also here, there, Let's add more titanium white. And there. 
that's my trees, the far portion. There, then directly paint the cobalt blue here. Just paint directly the cobalt blue. I'm going to paint directly the cobalt blue here. There, just paint directly the cobalt blue. By the way, guys, I'm using my one inch flat brush. You can also use a bigger brush than this, or a little bit smaller, or maybe half inch flat brush. There, now we have very nice. And this one also, I will add also here trees. There. Just observe my brush strokes, guys. There, maybe that one there. Next thing to do is I will uh, mix the color of this Mars black and the tile blue. I will mix these two colors to create more uh, darker uh, blue color and add small amount of titanium white so that it will not uh, too much dark color. I will paint here directly paint to this area here. This is my cliff. Here, I will add here cliff. There. And also this one. There. Maybe it's too much dark here, so I will paint titanium white. I will lighten this area because I will add also here a, a, a trees to this area. I'm going to lighten this a little bit here, there, that one there, and this one also, Mars black and the tile blue, add small amount of tight in the white, oops, I think it's too much white, uh, it's okay, it's still dark, then I will paint here directly, at the very lower portion, for my base color here, for the uh, cliff, there, that one there. Then after that, I will add also the lighter green there. So I will mix this, uh, the uh, yellow green and the titanium white. I will mix these two colors to create more lighter green. And I will add here for my lighter color, my trees here, a little bit nearer here, so this one, or maybe the light green color, we will add here the light green color, I'll add here the light green color, Add more light green color. There. I will add also the yellow color. I'll add here the yellow color. There. The yellow color. That one there. I will paint directly the uh, yellow green color here at the very to this area just paint directly the yellow green color there and after that the green color or the uh, light green color here just paint directly the light green color there I'll paint directly the light green color here just selecting the area there light green color There. This are my, these are my trees or the group of trees to this area. There. Maybe I'm going to add also the titanium white for the highlight of this uh, trees here. There. 
there then the orange color I will add also the orange color or paint directly the orange color here I'm still using my one inch flat brush there then the scarlet red just paint scarlet red here there then after that I will uh, paint here the uh, titanium white I will minimize more dark color to this area because I will add here newer trees to this area uh, just blend this area here I will uh, blend this a little bit here the titanium white there then the tallow blue I will I will paint directly the tallow blue at this area at the lower portion. The tallow blue there. I will paint directly here the tallow blue for my water to this uh, area. There. Then the yellow color I will paint also the yellow color. There. Just paint more yellow color for the another color effects to the water there let's paint more yellow color but I'm going to blend this yellow color to the uh, tallow blue so that it will create a very nice uh, water or the green color of the water there and there just I'm still using my one inch flat brush for this then after that the uh, the yellow green color I will add also the yellow green color then maybe the uh, I will paint directly the cobalt blue also there the cobalt blue There, this is only the base color of my water to this area. There, and also the tallow blue. I will paint here directly the tallow blue. There, for my base color of my water or the waterfall. For the base color of my waterfall to this area here. Then also this one, the yellow color, I will, I'm going to paint directly here, the yellow color. Because the trees to the uh, right side is the yellow, so I will paint yellow color. There. And also just blend the yellow color here. There. That one there. Then after that, I'm going to uh, uh, create here first the uh, color the cliff. So we're going to uh, darken this a little bit here. The uh, tallow blue and the marsh black color. I will, uh, I will darken this here a little bit. There. Maybe that one there. There. Then I will change my brush into uh, thin flat brush I will paint here the tight in white this area Just paint directly the tight in white paint the tight in white here there paint directly the tight in white lots of tight in white at the far portion here there maybe the one and the water just observe my brush strokes here guys there then after that the uh, the whole viridian green I'm going to add also the viridian green here for my grasses and the uh, the uh, leaves here the color of the leaves just paint directly the viridian green 
there. Maybe that one there, the Viridian Green. And also this one, I will paint also the Viridian Green. For the base color, my uh, leaves here, this area. These are the leaves that are not affected with the lights. Too much light or the highlight coming from the uh, light source. There, I think. It's nice now. The Rushina and the Mars Black Color or the Scarlet Red. I will mix the Rushina and the Scarlet Red. I will add here the color my cliff. There. Paint directly here. There. Paint the Rushina color. Directly paint the Rushina color. But I will uh, add that one dark color so that it will minimize more li light color for the uh, color of the cliff. There. And the orange color. I will add also some orange color here. Some orange color to this area. I'm going to add more yellow color here. Just paint directly the yellow color to this area. I think a, uh, uh, some area here is dry and the other area are still wet because the uh, paint that I, uh, the paint are uh, a little bit thicker so uh, it's still, that, still wet. So let's continue adding the yellow color here and this one I will paint also here the titanium white to this area because I'm going to add here yeah, another color of the trees there just blend the titanium white there that one there I will get my number 10 flat brush and I will uh, mix the color of this marsh black and the rushina color and add small amount of scarlet red I just paint here for my color of the cliffs here there, Let's continue adding the color of this cliff here and the mars black color. Just add the mars black color here for the shading effect to this cliff or some parts of this cliff that are uh, not affected by too much uh, light. That's why I, I'm going to darken this a little bit here at the very lower portion, especially the lower portion here. Uh, I will uh, dark this a little bit using this mars black color. There, just blend here at the very lower portion here. There, and after that, just continue adding with the uh, Rushina color here. I will add a Rushina color for the color of my cliff or the highlight effect. Some uh, stones to this cliff here using the Rushina color there it's very nice now there I think that's nice I will add some I will add some orange color there I think it's very nice now. Then the uh, Naples yellow also. I will add also the Naples yellow for some uh, more highlight effect to this cliff here. I will add more highlight effects. There. That one there. I'm going to mix the color of this Naples yellow and small amount of Mars black. I will mix these two colors and add the orange color. Let's add orange color and just add small amount of titanium white there. I will add here for some highlights effects. I'm using my number four round brush there. Just blend this a little bit here. 
there and add some small amount of titanium white where the uh, highlights are coming from the uh, light source there just selecting the area just small amount of light color there I also just blend a little bit to create a very nice uh, color of the cliff to this area there I think it's very nice now there in the Mars black color I will add also the Mars black color just blend this Mars black color at the upper portion for more uh, dark or the shading effect to this color area here there just add small there and then just blend small there it's very nice that's very nice there I think I'm going to add also the uh, the light green color at the very lower portion I'll add here the light green color I'll add the uh, algae effects to these uh, stones there I'll add the algae effects using the light green color there and the light green also just blend this light green color light green color more light green color here going down to the water and also nearer to the falls the waterfall add more light green color there I think that one there and I will minimize a little bit highlight or the in the viridian green I'm, I'm going to add also the viridian green here little bit dark color of the uh, grasses here at the upper portion also I will minimize more light color here there then the marsh black color and the rushina color I will mix these two colors there to create a little bit dark color I will add here a little bit shading effect to the stones or the uh, small cracks here on my stones there there it's very nice and good looking now I like effects to this cliff there the napples yellow just selecting the area here for the napples yellow Just continue here, adding the Naples yellow there. Just blend a little bit there at that part area. That one there. I will mix the color of this Mars black and the Rushina color, the Mars black and the Rushina color. Mix these two colors there and add Talu blue. I will paint this one here. For more nicer color of the uh, stones to this area, this part there, that one there, then some Rushina color. I will add also some, or maybe I'm going to mix the color Rushina and a uh, light green color there, and add the uh, tally blue, small tally blue there. I will paint here for some stones to this area here or this cliff there then some Mars black color I'll paint the Mars black color here some shading effect to the stones there Mars black color Paint directly the Mars black color there. I'm using my number 12 flat brush for uh, this area. Let's paint more Mars black color here for the shading effects to the stones there. Going to this area here. That one there. I'm going to get my flat brush. 
small uh, flat brush. I will mix the color of this orange, orange, and also the uh, this one, the uh, cobalt blue, the orange and the cobalt blue should be more orange color there. In cobalt blue, there. Just add cobalt blue. That one there. I think I'm going to add also this one here. Or maybe I will add small amount of titanium white or the white color there. Uh, maybe well, it's time to add here the uh, color of the stones here or the highlight effect for the stones to this area. There. I'm going to add here the highlight effects. The napple yellow is the we're going to add also the napple yellow. We directly paint the napple yellow here. There and the uh, Rishina color. That one there is very nice and good looking. With the napple yellow, just paint more napple yellow here. Just paint more napple yellow there. Then the uh, Rushina color. I'm going to add the Rushina color here. And just blend a little bit here. This is my stones to this cliff. There. Then the titanium white and also the napple yellow. I will uh, mix these two color, And I will add some highlight there or maybe titanium white just paint directly the titanium white there that one there also just create here the napple shallow There, just paint the napples yellow here. It's very nice now and good looking. Then the marsh black color, I will add also the marsh black color. Just add here the marsh black color little bit uh, shading effect to the stones there there mass black color it's adding the shading to this uh, stones here it's very nice I mean uh, the shading is very uh, dark to this area because this area is not affected with too much uh, lights so I will uh, make this a little bit more uh, dark color or create more dark color to this area here for the stones there I think that one there it's very nice now then the next thing to do is I will uh, paint also the uh, scarlet red here I'll paint here the scarlet red and there just paint directly the scarlet red that one there then after that the yellow color also I will paint the yellow color to this area here for my color of this grass, uh, the leaves to that area. Then the orange color, I will paint also the orange color for the highlight of the trees to this part. There and there. Then after that, I will uh, mix the color of this titanium white, titanium white, and the yellow color. There to create more lighter color and just paint here directly. I'll paint here directly here. Or just paint directly the titanium white to this area. Just there. Titanium white to this area here. I'm using my number 12 flat brush still using. There. The yellow color. I will paint also the yellow color. Directly paint the yellow color here. Paint directly the yellow color. That one there. It's very good and good looking. It's 
very nice then the uh, I will uh, darken this a little bit here the the lower portion using the viridian green there that one there that's there that's nice then for that I will uh, get my number four around brush I will add here the uh, bronzes I'll add here first the bronzes and the trunk small trunk there I'll add here a trunk using the mars black color the bronzes the twigs to this area I will, I will create first here so that I can easily add more detail later for the uh, trees this area there this one small trunk there the very far portion there also this one I will create here a trunk using again the Mars black color there just continue adding with this co color the Mars black we have a very nice color of the uh, trees to that uh, area there that one there now we have very nice trunk to that area the uh, cobalt blue I will add the talu cobalt blue I will add also here the cobalt blue for more color the trees there cobalt blue there the far portion then the yellow color also the yellow color there very nice I'm going to add also the uh, yellow green color to this area here I'll add here the yellow green color for the uh, highlight of the uh, some leaves to this area there that one there I will mix this one, the, uh, the cobalt blue and the titanium white to create the sky blue color. I will paint also this one here for some color of the uh, leaves to this area. There. That one there. And I will paint also the orange color to this area here. Let's paint the orange color just directly paint the orange color here there Let's paint more orange color I will add here a newer tree a newer group of trees to this area here there Let's paint more orange color and after that the yellow color I will add also the yellow color for highlight color effects to this tree there a uh, the yellow color just continue adding the yellow color here for the highlights of this tree there very very nice here color my tree so this area that one there then the, the light green color at the very lower portion I will add also the light green color there for some leaves of this uh, lower portion of this tree Let's add the light green color there it's very very nice and good looking trees to this uh, area there and the yellow green color I'll add also the yellow green color for some highlights of the uh, uh, leaves here at this area. There. Then after that, I will uh, continue this area here. I will paint directly the uh, red color. I will paint directly the red color here. Let's paint directly the red color there. That one, that, this is only the base color here of this area. This is, I will add here the, the red uh, tree to this part. 
Then after that, I will uh, add also here a yeah, maybe dark color. I will mix the marsh black and the uh, viridian green there. I will create here the dark color of the leaves. I'm going to select some areas to these leaves here for the shading effects or are the leaves that are not affected by too much lights. That's why I, I'm going to add here dark color leaves. There. Uh, very, very nice now. This one also at the very lower portion. I will, I will darken this a little bit here. There. And after that, I will uh, uh, get my number 4 round brush. Then I uh, mask black color. I will add here the uh, trunks, trunk or the tree trunk here. There. And the branches also. I will add also the branches here using this mask black color. Branches of this trunk. There, I, I'm going to add more trunks to this area because this area is my group of trees. There, also this one. I will add a small trunk there. That one there is very nice and good looking painting now. There. Just continue adding with the trunk, the trunk to this area, using this Mars black color, there, there, now we have trunks, and after that I will uh, make that, uh, I will add a color, You're using the Rusina color, I'll add some color of these trunks, a very basic color using the Rusina color or the highlight of this trunk. I will add here the highlight color. Just the basic highlight here. I'm not going to give more. I will not give more uh, highlight or detailed highlight here. Just the basic one there. So this one, that one there. Now we have very very nice group of trees to that area. Just continue adding with the uh, basic highlight for these trunks here, or the group of trunks, or the group of trees, rather. Just continue here the highlight there. Now I think it's time to add also the uh, viridian green. I will add also the viridian green here. There are some leaves to these uh, trunks, or some leaves, or it so that it will uh, give more realistic effect to the uh, trees or group of trees to that area. Then after that, they, uh, I will mix the color of this cobalt blue and titanium white to create a sky blue color. I will add some sky blue here for some effects. Or the other color of the leaves to the trees. There. Let's add more sky blue color here. Some highlight color effect to the uh, leaves there. This one lower portion here. There. I think it's very nice now to that area. Then after that, the, uh, the uh, yellow green color. I will add also the yellow green color. For more highlight color effect to this area here, this part. There. Let's add yellow green color. There. That one there. Let's add more yellow green color here. We have a very nice color that grew trees to that area there. Maybe I'm going to give uh, some detail for that uh, for that trunk. I think it's not yet, or it's cover everything here. That's why I will give this more detail for this trunk. 
there the mask black color will give uh, deep to this uh, trunk to this area here so that it will uh, create a very nice there now this one creating more trunks here there we have very nice color of the trees to this area and a very good basic uh, group of trees or forest to this part the left side of my canvas there then after that I will uh, paint here maybe I'm going to mix the color of this uh, orange color and the Mars black color I will mix these two colors the orange and the Mars black and add the uh, tile blue add more orange color there there and the titanium white create this kind of color I will add here for the color of my cliff here to this area I will not uh, give more highlight color effect to this area because this area is not affected by too much lights so I will uh, create here not too much light color just dull color here for this uh, cliff there that one there it's very good good uh, basic uh, color here for this uh, cliff to this part of the left side of the canvas there then the uh, light green and the 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 light green and the Mars black color just mix these two colors and add the Rushina color there to create this kind of color I will paint also this one here it's only the base color my cliff to this part there and after that I will paint also the Rushina color Paint some Rushina color here for this cliff. There. Some Rushina color here. there that one there then the uh, I will add also the Mars black color I will try some uh, maybe I'm going to mix the color of this Mars black I will mix the Mars black and also the uh, orange color there I'm going to mix these two colors to create this a uh, little bit not too much dark I will uh, add here for the uh, shading effect for the uh, stones to this part this area here yes we have very nice uh, color of these stones here for this cliff there that one there now I think we have very nice good looking stones to this area later I'm going to add also the algae effect to this area here there dark color there that one there then the orange color I will add also the orange color some orange color here but I'm going to blend this orange color so that it will create a very nice a uh, nice uh, color the cliffs to this area but I'm going to select also for this orange color selecting some orange color here there that one there then the Naples yellow uh, I will add also the, some Naples yellow here Naples yellow
there. Oh, I think we have very nice, colorful uh, or the basic stones to this part. Just observe my brush strokes, guys. There. That one there. And after that, the light green color. I'm going to add also the light green color here at the very lower portion. I will add here the, uh, I will add here the algae effects to these stones. There. The algae color. Using the light green color also. Some algae there. I'll add some algae effects to this area here. There. We have very nice stones to this part area or this area here. There. That one there. And also this one. Just continue adding the light green color. There. For my algae effect, the stones there. And the light green color or the uh, yellow green color I will add also the yellow green color it will be a highlight color effect there the yellow green color here there I'm going to mix the color of this uh, Naples yellow and the titanium white. Naples yellow and the titanium white. I'm going to mix these two colors and I'm going to add here for more light color effects for the highlight of this uh, area. There, I'm going to create here highlight effects. There, and this area I'm going to uh, uh, mix the color of this orange and the uh, scarlet red. The orange and the scarlet red and add a uh, cobalt blue or the tallow blue. We'll add the tallow blue there to create this kind of color. And I'm going to paint this one here for the dark color here, the shading effects for my stones to so this area here. There. Just blend a little bit here. That one there. It's very good and nice looking there. Or the lighter orange. I'm going to mix the color of this titanium white and the orange color. Titanium white and the orange color to create the lighter orange. I will add here. I'll add some highlight effects there. Just Oops, I think it's too much. So we're going to uh, darken this a little bit. It's too much here. So we're going to darken this a little bit here. There. Maybe the orange color. I'll add here the orange color. There. Very nice now. That one there. Then the Naples yellow. I will add also the Naples yellow. Selecting some areas. There. That one there. Then the uh, Rusina color. Oh, I will mix the Rusina and the uh, Scarlet Red. There, this color I will add here.
up and there, then the dark color, or the uh, cobalt blue, or the tile blue, and the Mars black color, there. And I'm going to add some detail here, or the deep, deep color here for the uh, shading effects to the stones, there going to create here the shadings there I think it's very nice and good looking stones now to this area here uh, there that one there no we have very nice good looking stones to that area so the next thing to do is I'm going to create the uh, uh, the tree to that area there so the first thing to do is I'm going to paint that one the uh, maybe the uh, dark or the uh, scarlet red here just paint directly the scarlet red I will add here the uh, the autumn tree to this area just paint directly the scarlet red to this part there scarlet red just paint alert directly scarlet red here for my autumn tree to this part that one there that one there it's very nice then the uh, talo blue and the marsh black color I will mix these two colors talo blue there I will paint this one directly here I will add here yeah, the, uh, the sand and the soil to this part there just add here then the uh, viridian green also I will add here for more um, greenish dark color effects to this part there later I'm going to add more detail for this part but now I'll, I will add first the uh, the base color for this area and also this one I will add here a dark color because I'm going to add here the uh, the uh, small there tallow blue and the Mars black color just mix and add here just blend a little bit here for the uh, exit uh, color or the exit area for my exit area for my water there just blend a little bit going to the upper portion there to my waterfalls just carefully just like that what I have here that I have that I have here just carefully mix or just carefully blend there just there and this one here and after that maybe it's time to add also the uh, here I will uh, add first the uh, the uh, cobalt blue for my waterfall to this part I'll add first the cobalt blue for the falling water here this is only the base color of my waterfall or the falling water to this area there that one there that one there then but before I'm going to color that one I will add first the light green color here for the algae effects to my stones to this area I will add here the light green color for the algae effects to my stones the light green color there just adding the light green color There, yeah, very, very nice color of my stones. This is my algae. There, 
That one there. That's very nice now. A little bit blonde here. The edges, this algae effect there. Going to that area there. Then after that, I'm going to get my number 12 flower brush. And I'm going to mix this titanium white and the cobalt blue to create the sky blue color there. And I'm going to add here, carefully add here, for my falling water here. There. Just add more, a little bit tight in white, the uh, sky blue color. Just add more here, for my falling water, there. That one there, maybe I'm going to change my brush now. I'll change my brush into a smaller flat brush there, my number four flat brush. Just mix again the titanium white and the uh, just add titanium white more, titanium white to the sky blue color. I will paint also here for my falling water. There. That one there, and maybe the titanium white also. Just paint, just selecting the titanium white here. Just carefully paint the titanium white for the falling water. It's very nice when uh, you use the uh, smaller uh, flat brush, like what I have here, the, uh, to create more. Uh, detail for these waterfalls there just going down here just paint or tighten white there just observe what I did to my brush there That one there. And after that, the uh, I will I will uh, a little bit make that uh, blurry or just just uh, I will create this one like this. Just observe my brush strokes there. That one there. Then after that, uh, make this a uh, little bit this color the water. I will paint directly the this is the cobalt blue here. Let's paint directly the cobalt blue for my water. In the cobalt or the mars black color, just selecting the area here. Mars black color there. Also this one, the Mars black color, or the Mars black color, there. Just carefully blend this color. That one there. Add a dark color, a dark blue color also. There. That one there. Then after that, I will uh, paint also the, the yellow color, or the yellow green color, I will paint here a little bit nearer to this area uh, later I'm going to blend this yellow green color there the yellow green color nearer a little bit nearer there there this one also here 
then it's time to add also the the cobalt blue but ye, but it should be a blend this cobalt blue to the yellow green color to create this kind kind of color a very nice color effect to the water there there That's very nice color of this water. Beautiful color of that water. Then the uh, tile blue. I will add also the tile blue. So selecting some area there. Put a darker uh, water co color. The, that area there. The tile blue there. The tile blue. Just continue adding the tile blue. There. Now I think it's time to add also the sky blue color, the uh, cobalt blue and the titanium white. Just create this sky blue color. I will paint also here and also just blend a little bit there just blend a little bit the sky blue color more lighter sky blue here there Just add more sky blue color. Sky blue color, lighter sky blue, lighter sky blue. There. That one there. In the cobalt blue, I will add also the cobalt blue here. Just add more cobalt blue to this area. Just blend also a little bit. Just observe my brush strokes. Paint directly the cobalt blue. Going to this area here. There. That one there. Now let's continue here. I stop for a while and my painting now is completely dry. Everything here is dry so I can easily add another uh, detail. Easily detail because uh, no more uh, color that will blend if I'm going to apply another color because it's totally dry here. Everything is dry. So let's continue here. I'm going to mix the color of this scarlet red and the mars black color. I'm going to mix these two colors, the scarlet red and the mars black color. I'm going to add titanium or the white color. I think it's very warm, so I am going to add a small amount of viridian green there. That one there. This color, what I want here, I will add here some stones to this area i will add some stones there i'll add stones the soil and the grasses here at this area there that one there the next thing to do is I'm going to uh, mix the color of this Naples yellow and the Naples yellow and a small amount of mars black color. There, the small amount of mars black color to create and add titanium white with this kind of color. 
Then after that, I will add here. Oh, I think it's too much uh, light color. So a little bit uh, tallow blue. There. Okay. I will add here. There is only a, some uh, lighter color here, but I will uh, make that another. I will create another effects or the war the little bit darker color and a little bit warmer also the orange the rushina color, mars black. I'm going to mix these three colors and I'm going to add here this color that I want here. There. This is my soil and the uh, the sand and soil here. That one there. Just continue adding with this kind of color. There. Then the blue color and the scarlet red. We need to mix these two colors, scarlet red and a bit tallow blue. There, I will add some dark color here for my soil. There, add some dark color to this area for my soil and the sun, the stones. There, then after that, I'm going to mix the color of this rushina. Roshina and a small amount of Mars black color, just small amount of Mars black there. I will add some or just add a little bit scarlet red, small amount of scarlet red. And also I want to control more warmer color, so I will add light green color. Just a little uh, there to create this kind of color. And just paint here for my sand and soil. There, there, just blend a little bit, just blend a little bit here, there, that one there. Then after that, maybe I'm going to make that a little bit detailed for that area, to that area there. So I'm going to mix the uh, Mars black and the the blue color or the cobalt blue, Mars black and the cobalt blue. Then I'm going to add small or the uh, scarlet red to create a little bit warm color, warmer but it's it's dark. Then I will add here some detailed or the uh, shading effect. For my soils here, soil the stones and also the the uh, the sand, the soil, the stones to this area. I'll add the shading effects there. Maybe the Mars black color. I will add also the Mars black color for more. Uh, uh, darker shading effects to the soil there just continue adding this color that one there now you have very very nice now even more nicer there that one there then I will add also the viridian green or I'll just mix the color of this viridian and the titanium white. I will mix these two colors. I will add some uh, algae effects here. The algae, this to the stones there.
the light or the viridian green and add small amount of or just paint directly the viridian green for the a little bit dark color of the algae to this lower portion of this uh this one there I think it's very nice in the blue color or the tallow blue I'll add also here for the shading effect to this uh, uh area there don't you don't worry for the uh waterfall because we will add some detail that one later I will add detail later after I'm going to add the shading effect to this area here there the tall blue also this part I'll add, I, I will add the tall blue also a little bit uh, shading effect that will create a very nice and very uh, uh, beautiful uh, waterfalls there Let's add more tallow blue here for more shading effects here for the waterfalls. There, then the titanium white. I will add also the titanium white. Just observe my brush strokes. I will add here the falling water so that it will uh, cover the the uh, tall blue that I painted earlier there it's very nice now that one there also this one and this one just observe my brush strokes here I think we have a very very nice color of this waterfall here that one there then after that, this one first, I will finish this one first. So I'll paint also the, the orange color here. I'll, uh, I'll select some area here for the orange color. For the soil and the uh, stones, sands also. There. Just selecting the area here for the orange color. And also just blend this color here. There, we are very, very nice now. That one there. Then after that, I will uh, complete this water. I will paint here also the the viridian green here, and I will mix the viridian and the talu blue. I will mix these two colors, the viridian green and the talu blue. I will paint here. To minimize more lighter color here, I will minimize the lighter color to this area because this area is uh, affected by the, uh, the shading effects for my uh, cliff. That's why I will uh, I will darken this a little bit here. I will use this little bit Mars black color, the dark color there. That one there. Then after that, the uh, I will I will use also the sky blue or the yellow green color. There, the yellow green color. The yellow green color here. There. That one there. And after that, the uh, I will uh, this one also the uh, cobalt blue. I will add also the cobalt blue here. Cobalt blue. I will add here. That one there, it's very nice. Then after that, I will add also this sky blue color. 
the cobalt blue and the titanium white. I'm going to mix these two colors. There. Sky blue color. There. I will add here for the UV effects for the water. The weaves to this water here. I will add some weaves co weaves effect for my water. There. Just blend a little bit first. There. That one there. I think it's very nice now. Just blend a little bit here. There, I think. That one there, it's very nice, good looking weave effects. And I'm going to get my number four round brush. I will uh, add lighter sky blue, just more white than the uh, blue color. I will add here. Just observe my brush strokes here, guys. There, and a little bit blend of colors here. There, just add titanium white for the bubbles effect to the water. There, and this one I will add some bubbles here for this waterfall. So one also here. I will add some bubbles effect for my weaves. Maybe that one there. And a little bit uh, blending here. I'll blend some here. There, I think it's very nice now. I will add also the yellow color. Add yellow color here. Some color of the water. There, I think. Cobalt blue. I will add also the cobalt blue. In this, uh, this one here to the yellow color that it will minimize more yellowish color there then the Mars black color I will add also the Mars black color at this area here to create the shading effects to the stones Also this one here, I'm going to create here the Mars black color, just paint also the Mars black color, for the shading effects, there, we are very very nice now, that one there, then the uh, sky blue color, the cobalt blue and the titanium white to create this lighter sky blue. I will add also this one here. There. I'm going to mix the color of this uh, Mars black color and the uh, tallow blue. I'm going to mix these two colors and I'm going to paint here. I'm going to add here the uh, stones to this area here. And also the cliff. There, I'll add here. There. So this one here. I will add some to this area here. 
using this uh, darker blue color there there then after that the uh, Rushina color I will paint also the Rushina color here there Rushina color and also this one I'm going to uh, mix the color of this cobalt blue and the titanium white and add the Rushina color there I will paint this one here for the, uh, the cliff or the uh, <coughs> Highlight effect to this cliff here, this area, there, and then Rushina color. Let's continue adding this Rushina color here, there, the Rushina color. That on there. The Rushina color just blend this Rushina color so that it will create a very nice, uh, very nice stones here. There. It's very nice now for my stones of this area here. Using this Rushina color, you can. Create here very nice. Then the light green color. I will add also the light green color here for my algae effect to this area. There, the algae to this area here. Then after that, the uh, orange color. I will add also the orange color. Just selecting the area there. It's very nice now. It's very very nice. We're almost uh, done with this painting. There, the orange color. Just selecting the area for the orange color, guys. <coughs> orange color. Just continue painting with this orange color. There. And also this one. I will add also the here at the. Under water stones, I will add here. There, maybe that one there. I will get my smaller flat brush and I'm going to uh, paint also the Naples yellow. Just selecting the Naples yellow here for the highlight effect from for my uh, stone and cliff, cliff here. There. That one there is very nice. That one there I have very nice stones to this area here. There. That one there. Then the uh, titanium white, or I mix the titanium white and the Rushina color to create this kind of color, the lighter color. I will add also here, where they a little bit highlight here for the stones. There. Also this one here. I'll add some highlight effect to this area. There, that one there. You have very, very nice stones to that area there. And after that, I will uh, create also the or use this one, the Mars block. I will uh, use also the number four round brush. I will create here uh, the trunks to this area here using this Mars block color. I will create here a trunks. 
create here a tree and branches also there that one there so this one here just continue adding this trunk there and the branches also there and after that I will paint also the or maybe I will paint the Arushina Arushina color here for the highlight of this uh, trunk Arushina color there and after that the uh, I will add also here the the grasses to this uh, under these trees there using this yellow green color I will add the grasses here that one there then the yellow color I will add also the yellow color for the highlight of the grasses That one there. It's very nice, pretty nice also. Yellow green color for the uh, lighter color. Of this maybe I'm going to be use my number ten flat brush. Yellow green color here. Put the grasses to this area here. There. That one there. I will add also one uh, Naples yellow. I'll add some highlight color here in Naples yellow. There. Some Naples yellow here for the color of the trees. And the other color. There. We have very nice, even more nicer uh, effects to that area. Then the orange color. Selecting the area there, the orange color. There. That one there. Then after that, the, uh, the other side, I will mix the color of this blue and the titanium white, or the cobalt blue and the titanium white. With the sky blue color there, I will add also here for my water. Maybe I'm going to create I uh, get my number four round brush. I think it's very nice. There. That one there for my water here there just creating the water here that one there just get here for my water it's very good looking and very nice water here using the uh, sky blue color or the lighter sky blue I'm going to add here the uh, the a little bit weave effects there I think it's very nice now just get here that one there then the uh, maybe the uh, I will add also the uh, the cobalt blue. I will add directly paint here the cobalt blue with some water here or highlight effects to the water. Cobalt blue there. 
Just paint directly the cobalt blue. There, just observe my brushstrokes, guys. That one there. Then the viridian green, I will, I will add also the viridian green. Little bit uh, dark color here. Maybe I'm going to mix the color viridian and Mars black. There, I'll add some dark color here. There. So this one, just darken this the uh, area of the uh, water and the sand. It will create a very nice. Just blend here a little bit. There. Very nice now. And the lighter sky blue I will add also here. There. We have very, very nice water. Water effects. That one there. Maybe I'm going to create also a big a big tree here using the mass black color. Create here a big trunk. I will add here a big tree. There. And also the uh, branch, this tree. There. Create here branches. That one there. And I'm going to get my number for a round brush. I'll add here branches and the twigs to this tree. There. Also this one. That one there. Now I'm going to color this tree using the uh, orange color. I will color or the uh, cobalt blue first. I will color the uh, back portion of this tree using the cobalt blue or the highlight effect of this tree there. The cobalt blue. Let's paint directly the cobalt blue here for the highlight effect of this uh, back portion of this tree using the cobalt blue. There, I think that one there. Then after that, I will color that one the orange color. Or the, maybe the Naples yellow. For a little bit highlight effect to this tree. Naples yellow there. Just blend this Naples yellow to the uh, black color so that it will uh, Minimize more lighter color here for the highlight effect of this uh, tree. Naples yellow. That one there. In the Rushina color, I will add also the Rushina color. Then this one also, the Rushina color. I'll add the Rushina color here for the highlight color of these branches and the twigs there. There. This one. Then the orange color, I will add also the orange color for another color effect to the uh, skin of this tree. There. The orange color, just paint directly the orange color here. That one there, it's very nice and good looking tree now. There, let's continue adding this orange color for my color of this trunk here. There. Just continue adding the orange color. Maybe that one there. Maybe I'm going to paint directly here the Mars black color because I'm going to extend this uh, soil here. Uh, because I will add grasses to this area here. 
just extend this first the dark color for my uh, soil to this area there then I will paint that one a Rushina color for the color of my soil in this area here there the soil here then the uh, orange color just blend this orange color also there and after that the uh, the napples yellow I will add also the napples yellow here but selecting the area there then after that the uh, the light green color I will add also the light green color here for the uh, some algae effects and also the color of the uh, some grasses here there grasses and the algae effects to this area here that one there then the orange color I will add also the orange color for the color of the soil there that one there it's very nice goo looking here that one there in the cobalt blue I will add also the cobalt blue here for the color of the water a little bit darker color here just blend this darker color there I'll create a dark color a little bit dark color in the Rushina color I'll add some Rushina color here for the color under water stones there that one there is very very nice indeed looking now and also this one a little bit dark color and after that the uh, Rushina color I will add also the Rushina color for the color of my underwater stones there that one there Now we have very nice color of my water and the stones in the sky blue color, the cobalt blue and the uh, titanium white. There, I will add here some waves effect. Add here some waves effect. there yeah it's nice to use this pointed brush because it will give more detail for this weave or the weave effect or small weaves to this part there then some lighter color the titanium white I'm going to add some here a little bit bubbles effect There, maybe the one that one there. I think we're going to finish this trees here or the tree, the other side. I'll paint directly the scarlet red here, some scarlet red to this tree. There, the scarlet red, let's paint directly the scarlet red to so this one some scarlet red there then after that the uh, the orange color I will I'll paint also the orange color for the uh, highlight of this tree the orange color there and I'll add some orange color here this one also for the highlight effect of this tree there 
Let's continue adding this orange color there. So this one, the orange color there. You have very nice colorful trees there or the tree. Then I think I'm going to mix the color of this orange color and the titanium white there and add the cobalt blue, titanium white, or this. then add orange color. So add more orange color there for the highlight effect to this part. I will add the highlight effects, yeah, add more titanium white. Or the titanium white rather also. Can add titanium white here. There. Maybe that one there. And this sky blue color. I will add also sky blue color here. For the highlight effect to this uh, branches there. That one there. Then maybe I will add also the yellow color for that there. Add more yellow color here for the younger uh, color of the uh, the leaves. There. So this one, the yellow color. That one there, the yellow color, and also this one. Add uh, the yellow color there. So this one, I need to add the yellow color also. Because this tree is a little bit bigger, that's why I need to add that one more color. And after that, I will uh, add also the, here, I will make the trunk. I will add detail for the trunk there. And add some branches also. There, also this one. Give detail here, the trunk. There. And also this one. The branch. There. You have very, very nice now more yellow color maybe this one here that one there it's very nice yellow color there i think and some branches here There, now we have a very nice, even more nicer uh, painting here. You know, guys, we're done with this painting demonstration. We have a very nice view here and a colorful painting. I hope this demonstration is helpful for you. And guys, don't forget to subscribe my channel for more free painting tutorial in the near future and also updates on my channel. You can also leave comments and hit like button below this video. And guys, thanks for watching. See you for my next painting demonstration. Peace.